Hey y'all, it's your girl Beyond Egypt and I'm back again with another video. If you are new to my channel, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you are a part of the family, the team, you already know what to do. Make sure you got that notification bell button on. So let's get into it. So today, 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 y'all already know it's Saturday. Um, it's actually the 26th. Um, today's nice though. It's nice out. I didn't really have too much plans, but I said, you know what? I'm gonna turn my camera on. I'm gonna let y'all in, see what I'm getting into today. I'm in the mood for some seafood, y'all. Some seafood. I'm in the mood for some seafood. So actually, we about to uh me and my daughter, we're gonna go get some seafood at the store. I'm gonna get all my seasonings, all my little obey, all that stuff. Corn, we doing sausage, we doing um potatoes. We're doing crabs, we're doing um, shrimps, and I wouldn't mind doing baby lobster tails. So, yes. And I don't know about y'all, everybody's a little bit different. I like getting mines already pre-made because, I, for one, it speeds up the process. I'm not trying to be cooking seafood all day. Two, I'm not a pro at it either. So, I know my sister, she know how to make that stuff from scratch. Kayla don't be playing, you know what I mean? But anyway, yes, I'm in the movie. That's what we're doing today, we're doing a seafood. And I might actually do a seafood mood bomb. So like I said, stay tuned to this video. To watch till the, to, <laughs> can't even talk y'all. What the heck? Stay tuned to the end of the video. Cause like I said, I'm gonna show y'all, I'm gonna bring along the process. I'm gonna bring y'all along at the store. Um, how I'm cooking it, my seasonings, you know, all that good stuff. And I'm gonna show you the final product and definitely, probably, most likely doing a mukbang at the end. So definitely stay tuned, all right? So see y'all in a little bit. <laughs> hey y'all, I got some seafood here. We just got the food done. I'm about to show y'all real quick or whatever. But I feel so much better. I was high. I was doing so too much or whatever. But yeah. But I'm about to show y'all the food real quick because it's done and I'm ready to eat. Hey y'all, I got my food. We outside with it. Hey, you see our food? Look at that. Uh, uh. Got my homemade beloved sauce. He got his, he just did his own little, whatever he got going on. Marination. And you can't go wrong with a Dr. Pepper because you already know. And I ain't had one of these in a long time. I don't even know where to put y'all at. Mm, I know these flies. I'm going back in there. Oh man, they mess. Hold on y'all, hold on. Okay, we back inside now. Don't mind my background, I look a little crazy. We trying to get this house together and then a little bit in order. But y'all, look at this. Don't look at my shrimp, I know it's a little. Mm. What you mean in order? The house in order, like get it in order. Hello. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, Yo, this you, sauce honey. is so good. Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't even know that stuff was at the bottom. What stuff? Yeah. Whatever that is, it tastes so good to me. <laughs> <laughs> See, he talking all this stuff, but he didn't want to be in my video. Yeah. Because he know. just trying to chow down. Really, Ooh, y'all, look at that drip. It's really, if I'm eating in real life, and then I look up after I'm eating something, and somebody looking at me, I'm going to be mad as hell at him. Mm. I'm gonna them, oh, my God, y'all. I'm going to ask him what their problem is. Y'all, go look up this Be Love sauce. You can make it right from home. I mean, she sell the packages online. Like the dry seasoning, all you gotta do is do the wet ingredients. It makes it easier, but it really ain't about nothing. No. And you, when you do your own um, powder seasons, you can put as much as you want. I just followed the way she did it, but it's bomb. Whew, it's a little heat to it too. But I think I made it better this time than last time. I this is the second time me making this, y'all, and um, this came out really good. I like a lot of onions in mine, so hold on. Get it. <laughs> Do it again. No. 
Mm. It's good though. That was called the end of it. Oh, that was corny, that one. <laughs> <laughs> You're corny. We need a topic. What do you want to talk about? I don't want to talk about nothing, really. Mm. I just want to eat. Y'all, he don't want to talk. He don't want to talk. I don't got nothing to tell you people. <laughs> he just want to call y'all people, y'all. Don't said, mind But him. I said you people. That's ignorant, though. But I ain't talking about no specific kind of people. Just you people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering why I'm holding my fingers like this. My fingers are so buttery right now. You gonna tell? Yeah, I baby. can't even. I can't even talk right now. This is so freaking good. Mm. Yo, and then at the bottom of the sauce, like this brown stuff, like all the seasonings, yo, that's where it hit. For sure, for sure. <laughs> mm. oh, yo, my sisters, y'all, they're gonna watch this video. They're gonna be so mad at me when they see that I made this sauce and made seafoods. Especially, yeah, my sisters, especially Jolie and uh, Kayla. Especially Kayla, because she gonna like she loves seafood. She always talking about getting seafood every day. I even got cussed out for this seafood. Mm. This is so good. <laughs> okay, when you all never mind. I need a nap. What? Here, I'll mm-hmm. What? Because I said cuz you really did. The bounty napkin. <laughs> My wasn't trick. Yo, this is so good. I made a lot too, y'all. I'm done. Alright, give them to me. Alright, then, bud. Thank you. Mm -hmm. She just want to be in the video. He wanted to be in the video. Look at his little head. Look. look Huh, try this one. This one got sauce on it. You love sauce. Go ahead. Yo, we even got carrot cake, y'all. We even went hard. We went hard for real. We even got muffins. We even got chocolate chip cookies. And I was fiending. Like, I woke up this morning, y'all, and I was just like, man, you know what? I really want some seafood. Like, this was like out of nowhere, just type. Like, something that was just randomly, like, just, you know what? I'm making seafood today. So. I can't hug my mama no more because she's allergic to seafood. That means you want to take a bath before you leave here. Huh? Yeah, for sure. You gotta make sure you do before you go back over there. <laughs> Thank you. I, it. I would hate to be allergic to seafood, what man. That suck. Mm-hmm. Secret turn red as hell and get hives of every damn way. Yeah, over there. Yeah, some people are allergic to like peanuts and like all kinds of stuff. Yeah, I remember one one time this was when I was little. Somebody was allergic when I was in camp. They was allergic to strawberries. I was like, what? Strawberries though. The only thing I'm allergic to is latex. But I'm glad I ain't allergic to no darn food. That really would suck. But the common thing is peanut butter or peanuts. A lot of people are allergic to peanuts. Didn't you? Your dad is allergic to peanuts, right? Yeah. Forget the fork. Here. Dang, that wipes out a lot of stuff they can, they can eat. No seafood and no um. Nothing with peanuts or peanut oil. I figured out why I'm allergic yeah. to daddy. What happened? I'm allergic to bees. Oh yeah, a lot of people are. For what? Huh? They got like a venom in their tail. After when I got stung in the lip. How real? <laughs> That was a Jay, you want to come say hi to the vlog? Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my God. <coughs> Hello. <coughs> That's right. <coughs> Y'all slowly will see, guys. There's a whole bunch of them. A whole bunch of what? Children. 
Yeah, and it need to be more. <laughs> so, you talking about? What? What? Well, if any females is watching right now, y'all know how that labor pain be. My labor pain be crazy. Story time. So I was in the uh, labor room, labor and delivery room, and he had the nerve to be in the corner. And then he had a uh, he had buffalo buffalo wild wings and came up to me and dangled the chicken over top of my face, talking about you want some. <laughs> and I'm in like contractions, my back is hurting. That ain't even funny, yo. And I was super hungry too, but. You know, when you're in labor and you have pain and stuff like that, you really don't... Uh, uh, tell them who put you in labor, though, how that happened. If you want to get all story time and shit. I, I can't say that on here. You can say it. I got my... What else? You can say it. <laughs> talking about dangling chickens. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't going to go there, guys. Was it garlic parmesan? Yes. Oh, yeah, then I did that. <laughs> <laughs> did you get it? Did I get it to you or I ended up eating it? Yeah, I was hungry He ate day. it. I ain't want it though. I would have threw it up or I would have pooped myself because they say not to before labor like don't eat nothing. That's why they don't they only let you eat like ice chips and like mm, depending they'll let you drink like ginger ale or applesauce or jello yeah, maybe good. sometimes. Where you plate at? I'm oh okay. But y'all I was in so much pain. I ain't even care about eating. This how my juice I chop. I do hmm. all of it. Yeah, I yeah. even put some green peppers in here, y'all. Drink some more of it. Go drink some a whole bottle of water. Y'all, my hair is getting drippy, y'all. Y'all see that? I bet you can't drink a whole bottle of water in like ten minutes. Y'all need to comment down some ch some challenge. Well, I, listen, y'all. I gotta get my comments fixed because I don't know why y'all can't comment. I gotta get my little sister to fix it. Because she know more about YouTube than I do. But, y'all, we climbing up there, y'all. We almost to 300 subs. Yo, I am so happy. I feel so blessed. Like, I get so excited about every subscriber. Like, you should see me. He be knowing, because I be telling him. <laughs> I be, like, jumping down like a little kid. Like, I be happy as heck. Me too. Oh, excuse me. Because it feels like an accomplishment. Like, I'm doing something good. I'd be doing something for people to want to subscribe. Shoot. I always wanted to be like, I don't know. Like, when I was little, I used to always want to be like a singer or like something. Like, I don't know. I just always wanted, even though I was a shy girl, I always just wanted to be like, I don't know. Now I'm not going to say in the limelight. I just always, I, don't know, I always wanted to show my talents or just do something like, that I was good at and I wanted everybody to see. But I was still trying at the same time. I know that kind of sounds crazy. Another story time. Yo, my family used to, they used to want to pay me at family functions like $50. My cousin Adam used to tell me, he was like, I'll give you $50 right now if you sing. I ain't never want to sing in front of nobody. They wanted to sign me up for American Idol when I was like 16. But obviously I wasn't old enough. You have to be 18. This is when American Idol was like popping. But I wasn't of age, and then by the time I did become of age, I, I got pregnant with my daughter and stuff, and things just changed. But <clears throat> yo, my story is amazing. No, my senior year of high school was like a big change for me in my life because we'll drink some water. if y'all don't know, like if you want to be showing off what you're drinking, like. A little barrel. I had turned 18. I had turned 18 when I was... In September, I had turned 18, my senior year, when I first started. And I had just started a new school. So... A couple months later, I find out that I'm pregnant with my daughter. And I did not know what to do. One of my friends, she was going to Votec. And she had got one of the uh, the little, um, little pea sticks or whatever. And we took it in gym class. And I did it like three times. And it said that. And I could not believe it. And then, in health class, we had the belly project. And I did the belly project. 
So by the end of the year, I was getting bigger and bigger. By February, I told my mom, because I was so scared, y'all. I thought she was going to smack me up. I don't know. My mom was mean. like, And I'm the oldest, so I had to like break the barrier like with everything first. So I knew my mom was strict. I wasn't really allowed to have boyfriends and stuff like that. So I already knew like she was going to trip. But I told her at the school, and um, she kind of didn't react the way I thought she was going to. But I only had a few more months until, you know, I was going to have my daughter. And it's so crazy because my due date was on the day of graduation. But I had my daughter a couple, what was it, like two days, two, three days before. And then I came, I went, I walked the grass and everything, came to practice and everything. Everybody was like, and just wants to be on bed rest. I said, heck no, I ain't, I ain't missing this. Because that's a once in a lifetime thing. And I had A's and B's in my class. And I was... I, my mommy, they have the baby. Going to school. Look at this. Yo, mom, look. I was going to school every single day with a big belly to the point where I couldn't fit in the desk. And I still had A's and B's. And I graduated a month early in advance. Mm -hmm. And on top of that, I, um, you eat your what was I going to say? Yeah, I had my daughter and then, um, mm -hmm. I graduated. And that's, yeah, yo, a lot of people stuff. can't even graduate yeah. regular. And I straight graduated with being pregnant. That's crazy. Like, that's, that's like, that's amazing. Feeling morning sickness and everything. And I still took my behind to school. That's like a real accomplishment. I didn't give up because I could have, I could have dropped out. I could have quit. Because a lot of people will do that. Mm -hmm. But I kept going. So, I'm proud of myself. I always look back on that. That was like one of the hardest moments in my life that I had to like get through. <clears throat> so, if whoever's watching that's underage or don't have no kids, don't be in a rush to have kids. Because it's a big responsibility, yo. It really is. I don't care what guy, what girl, you feel like you want love, you're going to be together forever. Yo, just wait. Just wait. Until you already established. Can you bring me some, um, can you bring me some napkins, bubs? Wait. Wait until you already established. Come on. Um, wait until you're already established. I feel like, you know, I, I would have loved to, like, went, like, you know, I would have loved to just do regular college and stuff like that. Oh, a lot of people don't even know this. I applied for Australia University in uh, Virginia and they accepted me. Yeah. I just didn't go because I had my daughter. It looks like I'm eating right. Because I didn't know what to do with her because, you know, I want to live. Virginia's kind of far and I would have had to live on the dorms. Yeah, eat some of your corn. Eat some of your, more of your food. I would have had to live in the dorms so I didn't know what to do with my daughter. I didn't want to be away from her. But I wish I could have experienced like college, like real college life when I was like young. That would have been kind of cool to do. Like get the real feel of like how you you know being on campus and stuff. Let's go to Morgan's homecoming. <laughs> what the heck is that? Morgan State homecoming. That's that's tell you how it is. Oh my god. You went to college, right? For a little bit. I just went to a lot of colleges, but like I wasn't like. Like a student there. Can somebody give me? Can I have this napkin? What is it? The napkin. Can somebody give us a couple more Damn. napkins, please? Anybody, please? I gave y'all napkins the first time. I know, time. but it's just not enough. <laughs> well, he experienced college life, or whatever. Y'all, yeah, he has a twin. He has a twin. I would love to have a twin in a way. I think that'd be so cool. Cool. How, how, I have a twin? No. You don't have a twin. I think it'd be too much if you had a twin, Lord. But anyway, y'all. Yeah, I think it'd be cool as heck to have a twin. But I guess it's different when you have like that, like when it's the opposite sex, like he has a twin sister. So I guess it's different when it's a boy and a girl, like, like if, it, you know, compared to if it was two dudes or two girls, like, I don't know. But that's how I kind of felt with my sister Kayla, because 
me and her are only like three years apart. Well, two and a half, three years apart. And we were pretty close growing up, like for the most part. I mean, we did our own thing, but I'm saying I always had a friend. Like I always had somebody there to play with and stuff like that. So it was always somebody there. Yo, me and my sister fist fought in the yard one time. Yo, we, yes. we've had to our times. Trust me. This morning, my mouth had a weird taste and it still has a weird taste. Did you brush your teeth? Yeah. Did you brush them again? Well, that's what you have to do sometimes. Most of the time. You know what I need, y'all? Where can I get a, uh, I need to know where to get like a, like a crab, like, Crackers or like some type of yeah, I don't know. What you call me? <laughs> no. <laughs> what you call me? <laughs> it is not a racial slur. YouTube is not a racial slur. I ain't trying you call to get me my a crab in a crack. No, listen. <laughs> I'm not trying to get my video um spammed or demonetized or whatever y'all got going on. Whatever it's called. Because they be kind of strict, yo. You can't even have uh stuff playing in the background. Ava, can you low it down some or something? You think that's enough for this video because it's been too long? No, it's not. See, he... Mm. <laughs> Did you just shine that on me? Nah. I didn't even touch it. It's right there. <laughs> oh, I was sitting there munching on this. Ooh, look. That was a good one. Look, they got the salt. Look. There it is. Hey. <laughs> I should have took a bite while you had it dangling. <laughs> that's right. But don't bite it, though. <laughs> <laughs> no teeth. <laughs> I can't wait till you get old. What? <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> Y'all. If you know, you know. <laughs> if you don't, you slow. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Can we hang up with the, with the people now? They not on the phone. Listen, y'all. We about to smash this food up or Come whatever. Come on, man. You got like... What? We got uh, freaking seafood juice flying everywhere. Oh my god! Here. Anyway, we about to go. I'm about to smash this food. I'm about to finish up. He want to eat in peace. The family want to eat. They want to put the TV up anyway. So, till next time. Like I said, please comment, like, subscribe, share. You know all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time. Peace. peace. <laughs>